Oh, well, not that close. You sure? Yes. Wait till you see that footage, Mom. What is going on? Tank is in literal Gosh. buckets. We demolished it. It's all going away. It's it's done. It's done for. <laughs> Tell people what's going on. So I'm doing a service on this guy's tank because he could not handle it. Sorry, I'm just kidding. <laughs> so I took, we took our whole tank apart because we needed to make some room. We got a little surprise coming. Woohoo. Couple of goodies. <laughs> so the way the rockscape was in the tank before there wasn't enough space for another sand dwelling coral it might look something like those. Um, <laughs> That's going in today. So we got to rearrange everything, make the rockscape more minimalistic, because all we really have are a couple of the torches on the rocks anyway. So we can kind of make this work. If you'll let me touch the tank. I was having fun by myself. I haven't got to do this in a while. See? See? He doesn't even love me. <laughs> but this is where we are right now. You, Finally you, got the, <laughs> the hairy back. You freshy clean. need my expertise. I mean, it's just a coral versus a plant. You put it in a tank, it's the same thing. Do you hear this? Noob. <laughs> <laughs> oh, call me a noob. Give me a toothbrush. We need a toothbrush. Anybody has a toothbrush, just send it, send it to us. You know the story. Is. We need another toothbrush. <laughs> um, so what's the next step? We got to figure out how we're gonna put the rock in, right? Next step is finding how to put the rock in. It's only 10 gallons, so it'll be interesting. And maybe some fighting. <laughs> it's like putting furniture together. It's like putting 10 pounds of rock in a five pound bucket and not knowing how to do it. I'm <laughs> fighting about it. <laughs> All right, let's get to it. Let's See it. you in like three hours with the tank scape. I got a tip for you fellas. If you're gonna do this together with your wife, or your sig fig, let them do their idea first. And then if it's wrong, then you can do yours, you know. That's our sea hare. Look at how cute he is. He started as literally a tiny baby. How big was he, Allie, when we first got him? He was literally like this big. He was so cute. Chris found him over at the farm. He must have just been on a coral or something. And we took him. And he it was just so cute. He has plenty of algae to eat. He's really grown. <laughs> He's like all like thinned out right now, but when he like sits on the glass, he's like he's like this big on the glass. <laughs> this is our rock going in. This is uh this is the scape so far. All the torches are going to go where that one is. The yayays are going to go on top there so they don't touch each other. The Zoro rocks there. And then all the meats are going here. So, fingers meats. crossed, right? <laughs> fingers all crossed. Meats. <laughs> all right, one's ginormous mess later in a bucket of rock and a really cute salty alley. <laughs> it's done. We just got to add a little bit more salt water. We weren't able to save all of it. But, uh, that's the new scape. <laughs> Insert sense. before picture here. <laughs> All right, show us the new stuff. So start it's... start small and then go bigger. So we got two, we got two uh, little flower pots here. The back one's a Ghani, and it's crazy colors. Something that, uh, we've never seen before. It's like yellow centers with like Teal? green. Yeah, with teal um, lashes on it. It's really cool. And then in front of it's an alveopora. It's like a pink alve. That was all. That was all Jeff. <laughs> so it looks like a turd in the tank right now. But uh, when I was looking at it at the shop, it, it they look like um, the best way I can describe it is like wagon wheels. The flowers, um, and some of them are pink petals, and some of them are 
like a tealish blue petal it's like a bi it's like you know like a bicolor hammer looks like it looks like a bicolor alveopora um and then <laughs> what well, ali's taking a picture of right now um this is the newest edition that wow. is my baby so um if any of you follow me at all on social media i had lost my prized trachea that I loved it was literally this big when I bought it and I have pictures of that and then it was this big when um, GSP just brushed against it and it stung a little spot and within a week it was totally dead so um, I cried <laughs> a lot when that happened um, and I had never seen anyone like it it was like really really awesome and then this one came in and I waited my two weeks <laughs> it was hard but I did and uh, I waited through our Black Friday sale, and nobody picked it up, so I had to. I don't pay know it. how. <laughs> this camera doesn't do justice. So again, insert a picture that Allie just took with the glasses and the right colors. It yeah. was bomb. I don't even need to adjust colors. Just the orange oh, filter. Oh no! Yeah, just you the know? filter. And yeah. it just looks outrageous. It's got yellow. Yes, actual yellow, green, red, blue, orange, orange. The thing's crazy. All the above. <laughs> it's a true rainbow trachea. And then, of course, the OG, the green one, and the little baby pink one. <laughs> All the torches are back in. Tank's super, like, cloudy right now. But. Cool. Super excited. And we got our scolies on. They're, they look unhappy right now. But. They're all closed up, but. Of course, lit by AI. <laughs> And uh, that's about it for this one. Thank you again for watching. Thanks. Keep it... <laughs> Salty. Keep, no, keep it freshly salted. Right. <laughs> See ya.